Hey guys, I just want to show you how we can quickly create an e-commerce site and we can start profiting from it immediately. So let's get started. So first what you want to do is put in the email. So I'm just going to put josh at joshblackagency.com. Obviously you want to put in your own email. Um, so let's get started. Put in a random password. Just going to put in a password for me. And then you want to create a store name. Now the thing about your store name, a lot of people get stuck up on this. Um, it doesn't really matter. You can always change it later by putting in a different domain. Um, and we're going to show you how to do that in just a minute. So for now, I'm just going to call this um, the Josh Trend Store. And of course, you can make this whatever you want. So I'm going to create the store. Now within a few minutes, we're going to have a store created. success your store is ready to go awesome okay so then you could just choose um, uh, you know anything random mine you know they want to sell on my only just getting started boom next first name Josh but and you can always change all of this stuff later Three go road. The city. <clears throat> um. <clears throat> so, if you are from America, um, it's going to make things a little bit easier because there is. Uh, certain payments that you can use in America that you can't use anywhere else. Um, but if you're not, it really doesn't matter because uh, um, and you don't have to put in your personal website. And then here, now we can just enter the store. Awesome. Now we have everything ready so we're going to do a few things before um, just to make sure that we get everything ready so first um, it already comes with a with a theme um, I suggest you get like a more personalized custom theme uh, just because this one is you know it's not really the best but you know it's good to start with so first we go to pages um, and we're going to add a page um, and this is going to be of our our terms and conditions, our policies, and things like that. What I suggest um, as well is by default the customer agrees uh, to receive personal emails. Or you can disable and hide this field. It's up to you. Um, but anyway, so first what we do is we do generate sample refund policy, generate sample privacy policy, and generate sample terms of service. I'm going to save that. So I'm going to copy all of this and then we're going to go to our store, so that here and copy this. So now we have our refund policy. I like to make this one capital refund policy. Save that. <clears throat> I'm going to make just a few pages so you can understand of how to make this, but um, you're going to also want some other pages. So let's just make okay. Um, <clears throat> so refund policy is done. That's it. Next, we make the privacy. What's crazy is that. Shopify has all all of the pages that you need and that it's pretty hard to get them without you know hiring a lawyer and things like that but it's all right here so I, for me I just like to take it from there and then we're gonna paste it here awesome. save that 
And then we're going to do the term of service. Save that. Now, this is the best part. Create a contact page. So, contact us. Um, and usually, um, you can create a wish list as well on some other themes. <clears throat> so, now let's create the main menu. Okay, so. Let's make sure everything's working. Okay. Oh, let me make that contact page again. Looks like I didn't save it. Oh, no, I did save it. Okay, so now we have one, two, three, four. Um, you can create your About Us page and um, if you want to create a wish list. But now let's go into creating the menus. So, first, we want to go to let's edit the main menu. Um, and I like to change this to shop now. Now we're going to add and I just call this the policy on the main menu. Um, you know you can add a couple more things um, yeah, that's pretty much. Okay, so now let's save that. Let's go back to navigation. I'm going to create one more menu. Policy. So we create refund policy. And I'm just going to call this refund. Then we get create the privacy. I'm just going to call this one privacy. And then terms of service. Add that. And now we have that. Now we're going to save that. And we're going to take a look at the store. Okay, so now we got policy, <coughs> refund, turn service, all that. We've got a shop now. Um, and, that, and that's just the beginning. So, uh, yeah, you can check that out. So, that's pretty cool. Um, so, let me just show you a few more things which is going to be helpful. So, we got our preferences. So we obviously want to put a pixel here um, and we also want to pick a plan as you choose the first plan and then we're going to turn this one off so people can start coming to our page. Uh, domains, you're going to buy a domain um, and that's why it doesn't really matter that it says Josh Trendstore um, and that's uh, pretty much it for now. Um, yeah, so if you like this, you know, subscribe, uh, comment, check out anything else. Uh, but this is pretty much basics for getting a Shopify store set up. Um, let's just do one more thing. Uh, customizing the theme. Just before I go. Okay, so we got our header. Uh, this is where we're going to put in our logo. And then we have um, we have the footer. We can add a newsletter and add payment icons. We can add more menus, main menu, <coughs> you know, different things like that. Yeah. 
say that. Okay. Then we also have our general settings where we can change colors. Um, and I like to make my colors green. This green is like go. Okay. Um, sale text. You can just kind of play around with the colors and uh, save that. And uh, that's checkout, you know, um, buttons to make them green as well. Um, and yeah, it's pretty cool. And then once we have a product, it's just going to look really, really nice where everything is going to be just continue shopping and things like that. It's just very it's much better. Of course you want to add, get a logo done and, and things like that, but for now this is pretty much the primary basics for set, setting up your Shopify store. Anyways, I hope you learned a lot um, and get to see your store. Um, but this is basics and this is Josh Black. Uh, subscribe and uh, I'll see you in the next video.